guys welcome back to my channel so today I thought I would do kind of like a weekend type vlog Um, a lot of the videos that I've been doing lately are more kind of hauls specific videos and I'm not really doing much this weekend but there's a few kind of smallish biggish updates that I thought I would film also just for ourselves to look back as memories Um down the line but yeah I just thought I'd bring you guys along we're not really going to do much today today's Saturday 3 o'clock literally haven't done anything all day um, lay in quite late and Gary made me porridge like that's the first time he's ever made me breakfast apart from mm. toast which was quite nice um, chilled had a shower slowly got ready kind of tidied my room a little bit um, so we're ready now, we're about to leave, we are, it looks like it's about to rain but we are going to get some lunch, late lunch, really late lunch. Um, maybe go call and see my mum in her work, then maybe go see my papa and Sybil. Um, we have some more updates which I might either just kind of film later or when we're having lunch or I'm not too sure. But I'm just going to bring you along, um, either tonight or tomorrow we're going to go to the cinema, my dad's now back. Um, go to the cinema with him to see 1917 which I'm really excited about love the cinema love going to the cinema there's quite a few new movies out that I'm busting to see um, there's that fantasy land which I really really want to see um, but yeah I'm just going to bring you along and see what we do we're also just going to go a little tiny 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 bit house shopping I know in the last couple of vlogs I've spoken about us getting a house and that kind of jazz there is some info on that but at the minute we're just going to go look at some things and I'll update you all properly later but kind of want to look at flooring and tiles and carpet and all that fun stuff even though we obviously don't have the house yet I'd like to have a good idea one how much it's going to cost and two what I would like for the house so that when it comes to the time it's not delayed and I'm not like faffing about trying to find something I'm keen on I think I look kind of strange today I don't know what it is Anyway, we're going to go now and I think we're just going to have Burger King for lunch, like nothing exciting or wild. Yesterday I literally did not eat all day, I was that stressed. And had a big Chinese and felt like physically violently ill, so I just want normal food. I don't even want chips, I just want a burger. And I am loving this um, jumper I got from Boohoo a little while back. Like it's it's a lot bigger than I thought it was obviously once it's washed it goes in a bit but I just love it being loose and baggy it's so comfy and we're in the rib leggings that I got in the cord from Boohoo also and then the new trainers that I got a little while ago how is it your hair <laughs> it's something else I want um I got Gary a, what was that a google stadia for Christmas mm -hmm. and he literally hasn't played it now we're in March so he was yeah. doing that thank god there's my Nutella from my porridge it was so nice Nutella and, and banana okay. yeah once you didn't brush the back of it this is the same thing he does this and he uses my brushes and then all obviously because my hair like shed like any person and then he'll come out he's got like all bits of long hair hanging from in the back of his head but anyway we're gonna go get some lunch and shop and chill and have a nice weekend the flowers are now dead okay so you're somewhat prop sorry for the bad lighting sorry for the bad angle really unflattering but anyway um we've ran in i'm obviously by myself right now we've ran in got our lunch we're going to eat it in the car and do a little bit of an update. Gary's just stopped in JD though because he is treating himself to some new trainers. Um, Venice. I've mentioned Venice a few times. We were obviously meant to go to Venice the end of March. It was Gary's 25th birthday present. Um, we were going there for five days. Five nights. Four nights, five days. Um, and that was in like two weeks time. <coughs> The coronavirus is scaring the pants off both of us more so gary than me i'm kind of like meh we'll see how it goes as time goes on and i'm hearing about more and more people getting sick it's put me off completely so along with that the potential of of getting ill also a lot of places in italy are closed there's a town that's like no more than an hour away from venice that's got a bar on like a ban on travel so I've seen and read online the streets are dead, the gondolas aren't even like in the lakes or the, the, the 
ocean the sea whatever it is um restaurants are closing you know like so many people are suffering because of this and it's really really sad because so many small businesses or even big businesses aren't going to survive this and it, it's horrible it's really really horrible but anyway we are probably 99.9% .9 not going to Venice which is very very upsetting I was so excited to go Um, always wanted to go to Venice and yeah it's now not happening and I would have loved to get away from this grim weather but anyway I would rather have my health than some photos and memories which I could make another time. So that's fine. We're now not going to Venice, but for my mom or my sister, one of them got Gary euros for Christmas or birthday, I can't remember. And they've obviously been sitting in the room. They were for Venice, but he's now not gonna get to spend those. So he's changed those in the wee money change shop and he's getting himself some new trainers. The boy has so many trainers, but he has the same type of trainers. I think they're called like court shoes. And they're like, they're not like trainer trainers, like running trainers. They're a specific type of shoe that he just loves and he always wore. But now that he's going to the gym and he's wearing joggers and like tracksuits and sweats and all that kind of stuff, he needs like trainer trainers, like, because they look better. And they're obviously more comfortable. So I felt a bit bad because obviously I've been treating myself like crazy lately, even though we're buying a house and he, God love him, has not bought himself anything he never does buy himself anything it's me anyway that buys him stuff but um yeah he's treating himself and he's getting some new trainers for himself and for the gym so of course we will show you those once he's got them they're actually really really nice and they're on sale so he's getting those then we're going to eat our burger king and that is pretty much it there is a big house update so i'll see if i can if gary wants to talk about it while we're eating or if he just wants to go ham on his burger i don't know i'm really concerned this food's gonna get super cold because he is taking his sweet ass time um but anyway You know what i'm just gonna talk i will talk about the house when he is back here he is with his shoes god love him <laughs> Tam was a wee bit too tight like it would have fitted but you got 11? i got the 11 because it was perfect there's plenty of room Oh, they're really soft inside. Mm. That's what I thought. They're very oh, soft. They're 45. Yeah, very spongy. Yeah, I really like them. I think they're nice. It was between these and a white one. I thought those were a wee bit nicer. And the worst. Don't get this dirty. That's quite like. But let's eat this quickly because it's going to get cold. It's funny though because somebody might have walked in last week and paid the yeah, 70 like, and then. Were they 70? I wouldn't have paid 70 for them. No, but then a week later, they're what, like 45 quid. Sweet chili, ask for barbecue, and I also don't know what one of those is diet. Barbecue, eh? Yeah, and then sweet chili, ask for oh, barbecue. You know what I mean? Like, I think the royals have gotten smaller. I remember Probably. it used to be a big, it used to be that extra bit. Maybe it's like a kid's one or something. There maybe, no, I don't know. Um, but, so it was updated about Venice. Hmm. Um, but the house situation, obviously, with the home mortgage thing, I'm not gonna go into like great, great detail. Will you try those and find out what's on style? Um, but yeah, it's just the home mortgage. mortgage. Oh, yeah, sweet chili's really nice. Left. Yeah, you're gonna have to use that. Is this one, man? Yep. That's the first time this actually tasted for black coat, like you can actually tell the difference. Meh. Oh, you put yours on? Oh. You can put yours on, alright. Um, so yeah, I'm not going to go into full details about the mortgage and obviously the ins and outs of it and stuff, but it's just a really stressful situation. Um, a lot of it I'm kind of having to do by myself. For specific reasons. But... It's not even that, it's having to get like... 90 million different types of bank statements and just so many things and you're panicking and the offer on the house has been accepted i did a quick little video in my car the day it was accepted just so i can look back on it you know yeah the excitement but so obviously we were going back and forth with offers the offer's finally been accepted but now we're sorting out the whole actual mortgagey financial side of it which we should have done first um it's kind of the wrong order so that's the annoying thing now we know that she's happy you know when she's selling the house for the price that we've agreed things take up to 12 weeks anyway yeah and i don't think it's gonna take that long once 
the other thing that's accepted, what i wondered though it. is it 12 weeks because all this is going on or is this meant to be sort of first and then it's 12 well, weeks i think people people have a rough idea and they say 12 weeks mm. but that could be 12 weeks because somebody has to move out and then somebody else has to find another home mm. whereas i think it's going to be less because he was only renting it out because he's not even living in it doesn't have yeah. to find anywhere yeah else. so the house that we're buying the house is she doesn't there. live there at the minute she rented it out i feel like she's given us probably more time because mm. she knows it's it was good that way because that she way. wasn't in a major rush she's obviously got another house and we're not in a major rush either so it was kind of good i'd say if the next thing gets accepted it could be a week or two Here's and chance. only because sweet chili it's really nice you're not having the whole chip okay. it's going to take a lot less time once it gets accepted yeah i just can't wait for all the legal stuff to be sorted and um be waiting for the keys really that's it and just be waiting for things to be finalized but like, like that's all stuff i have nothing to do with at the minute it's like everyone wanting and waiting on things from me which is what's stressing me out and i'm trying to get it as soon as i can and make sure that it's right and we don't really have a mortgage advisor that will be done for the week kind of have a financial advisor but not a mortgage advisor so um anyway hopefully we're still waiting on like approval of all the stuff that i've sent Hopefully that will be shorter. You're not really in this. Huh? Sorry. So we're going to eat this. Then, maybe just see Papa and Triple tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Do you think? I just kind of was excited to tell them the news about the house. We'll go shopping and then sure we'll see what time it is and see if yeah. we want to call see Papa and Triple for a week of tea. Might as well go shopping. I'm not going to Enjoy it. Only left three. <laughs> I was going to say, where's my own chips? Did I not get some? You did, hun. You got a full bag. Okay. Sure, is that? I don't know. You try mine. Mine's fizzy, isn't it? Well, yours is flat. Anyway. Apart from my vegan thing, I can't remember the last time I had a fucking Burger King. You didn't. I'm not one ages. This is really hot. I had stayed one. Done well. Whew. By the time I even went in, if you had went in and done that and then got McDonald's, it would have been This is freezing. a bit of a pathetic burger, to be honest. Right. But a nice butt. I wish we got a Whopper instead. They're not really great, the Whoppers, the same ones. If anyone's confused by we've got the same thing, you tell them, boo. Hmm? You tell them. What? Why we've got the same thing. Oh, because it was on the app. Go. I wouldn't want to pay more than four pounds. Save yourself some coin. But... No, I wouldn't, because McDonald's is like, you know, you need to get a yeah. good burger and chip for four pounds. Um, Burger King, I find, is always a little bit more expensive than McDonald's, but I do prefer it. Like, I prefer the, when the chips are hot, they're good, they're better. The burgers, wow. Well. The burgers are better, they are that wee bit bigger, but I love McDonald's 99p burgers. If I wanted a good big burger, I'd get a Burger King, but if I just wanted a wee burger, I'd go to McDonald's. Um, but Burger King app, save yourself some money. They, um, that girl was just staring at me, did you see her then? Um, they have offers on their app, so it's two, either like a Whopper or a Royale, and a how much was it? Good point. Seven ninety nine. A good more tea. Where I feel like they would be that by themselves. A Whopper is it not like seven okay. point? Oh yeah, no, yeah. They are, yeah. Do you know what I mean? So you're basically getting another one for free. The original Whopper is always the cheapest. Whereas if you get the steakhouse one and all and all that stuff. And Are you looking this? You gonna eat it all? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm like, I ever need help with anything by food? You don't need help, I just want it. <laughs> it's a wee bit like plastic isn't yeah. it? Yeah. No 
Do you have it? Do you have it? Do you have it? No, you have it. Okay. <clears throat> so it's like four o'clock, mm. four, four o'clock. Someone commented on my video and said, what accent's that? <laughs> wow. Rude. Oh, it's a weird accent, I suppose, if you weren't that oh, educated. Not probably genuine. Well, no, them. I know she was probably just curious. Um, if you weren't that educated on countries and, you know, geography, you might be somewhat confused why I sound like <laughs> Although I feel like I can hear an accent and I know where someone's from. Yeah. But because Northern Ireland's so small, maybe if you were from like South Africa, you wouldn't know. Well, it's like anywhere you go anywhere in the world, then you go, oh, you're from Ireland. Not really, no, it's Northern Ireland. No, they always say UK. Or Ireland. Mm, I feel like it's UK. And then they never really hear the Northern part. You know, say Ireland. It's like, oh, yeah, there's oh, no point. Dublin? There's no, no point. If you're from off. Northern Ireland, you go on holiday, you either just say you're from the UK or you're from Ireland. There's no. I think that's where they get the accent. If you thing say you're from up. Northern Ireland, they're like Ireland, and you just end up saying, yeah, yeah, fucking, yeah, of course I am. We're completely different accent to Southern Ireland, so we we'll obviously get really confused. Yeah, they probably think you're talking shit, making it up. <laughs> right. I'm really full. So we're gonna go. Right. Also, I'm on near two. Well, I would say near two fifty, but two three eight. Isn't it? I don't know. It's two three eight. Two three nine. Literally checked two minutes ago. Two three eight. Two hundred thirty eight, which I think is really fucking exciting. I think once I've kind of got to 250, I'll, I'll feel like it's kind of going in the right direction. The first while it feels like a drag. Like Norman asked me the other day, how's your YouTube channel going? And I kind of felt a wee bit more when I was like, I'm on like 235 or something, right. you know, instead of like 80 or even though like it's still 80 people, like it's still a no lot way. of people. I just think of it like I would not if there was 238 people in front of me, I would clam up and I wouldn't say a word. Yeah, that's it. And there's 230 people that have sat in their home and clicked subscribe. Anyway, let's go shopping. So we are in home base and we're looking at floor. The only one that's in. somewhat, yeah, just all clicks together. So obviously we're looking at laminate, quite like that, although I'd kind of like it to be a bit darker. I'm not a fan of like all one. these light ones. I don't know if that is. It is. I don't know. But we're gonna have a look at some floor, some tiles, what? Some floor, laminate floor, some tiles, maybe some carpet, and upstairs they have kitchens. Just looked on Instagram and read and listened to the horriblest, the saddest story about this girl um, whose husband has cancer and is dying, and it's broke my heart. I can't even find out who it was, but she's from Ireland and it's heartbreaking and I was being a Debbie Joyner because I was in a bad mood and now I feel weak but heartbreak. Is there a difference between <sighs> kitchen tiles and like bathroom tiles? I don't know. I quite yeah, like those beige ones, they're nice. Why you um, want them to go? Oh my God. This is hard. <laughs> I'm over grey. I quite like that. That's beautiful. Beige one. Oh no, I like the one beside that. They're both nice. Yeah, I quite like that too. That would be nice for a bathroom. What did you tell you don't get required? Wall and floor. I'm trying to like avoid people. Would you prefer like more of a shiny tile or a matte one? More floor. Anywhere. Well, kitchen, I'd like shiny. I don't know for bathroom. Quartz. Is it quartz or quartz? This is the kind of worktop I'd really like. Just. I think the one that they have in the minute is. Um, well, I don't really know what it is, but I think it's like a cheap one. It would kind of like peel at the edges if that makes sense. I'll show you what it's like, but this is like hard, hard. The one that they kind of have is like, what? It's kind of like this type of worktop. Um, you know, like, I don't know what that is, whether that's wood or what. Um, which is all right, but it just, 
looks a little bit cheaper so I'd rather have I think there's acrylic ones you can get but I like that just with white white work tops don't know about the tiles and then dark wood floor I think that would be really nice but like your new kitchen yeah. <laughs> um Solid and I wish we could have like a stove in the middle that would be good but yep. or a cooker I don't know if we like the marble type one or this I don't know if you can kind of see it's kind of got a fleck on it or the marble um I don't know actually I think I kind of prefer the marble one you just see a tiny bit rather than a full fleck and kind of up close it looks a little bit dirty 84 months to know don't like cupboards like this or we bit too modern I'd rather have ones with handles it's like a little maze are you not getting in I want to see weed <laughs> 700 pound yeah it'll be the the glass and the tray yeah that's right feel nice yeah that's some fresh that's that mermaid tile stuff in there it's mermaid. like cool oh, well the touch yeah Right. I think you just hover your hand over it. Yeah, don't know, right? He does these things without me even asking him to now. No, but lied. <laughs> <laughs> but what if you were like putting your head underwater? So imagine it's filled with water and you're putting your head underwater. Oh, no, but try it. <laughs> bye. -bye. <laughs> Yeah, I really like that. And then imagine that with like the white against it. That would look so nice. I don't know, maybe on the back of it. So the shop's a lot better. They've got a lot more tiles and floor. Charcoal oak. Let me like. Yeah, I like that. That one's nice, but it's just not dark enough. I don't think. <coughs> and then, well, I don't know. That one's like grey, black. Um, well, like this one, new range. There's no price on them. I like that. It looks really dark, like black on camera, but it's obviously just really dark brown. So we were in, just looking at sofas, and um, it's called Harvey's. Uh, Harvey's. The guy was a stalker. You may hope he doesn't watch our videos. He doesn't. <laughs> I don't think he's mountain. one of my 200 and something, but no. He's a lovely guy. Nice man, but just would not Meant go well. away. Like he said, is there anything I can help you with? No, just looking, what do you need? Like we need everything, so it's kind of like everything. Yeah, and then you said everything. Yeah, but then I was like, I wasn't look, I wasn't making eye contact when I was talking. Hey, you should have got we the need hint. everything. So and she then, needs a bed, she no. needs a mattress, she so needs a wardrobe. So then we looked at the sofa and he gave us the prices because he was dying to do that. Like he couldn't wait to do it and give us a print off, so that's fine. You wanted to print it off. Well, because I felt, well, what was I going to say? No. Right, so you're actually going to go and get a sofa out of there? No, because I know that sofa's half the price online. Just waste my time now. I wanted to look. I like looking for ideas and inspiration. Beautiful sofa, but for, it's too, it's, it's guys, thing. they're buying their same stuff from the online retailers that I see, 100%, and they're charging double the price. Will you find that sofa again? Oh well, of course yeah. I will. Yeah. Challenge me. Um, so we're going to go look in dreams just for a nosy because I didn't get to look in the beds in there. And spend about an hour and a half. Because he caught me out. He said, what do you need? I said everything. Then I'm just down there looking at the beds because we want a new bed. Um, yeah, and then he's like, this is the bed out. department. As if, why are you in the bed department? Because you've you already got a, bed. got a bed. Yeah, no, but I just wanted to have a look. I know, but... <sighs> he was like one of those annoying, um, Lovely man. lush employees that just fucking stalks you. Right. Then went into <laughs> dreams. The guy was ten times worse, maybe yep. just as bad. I told you. Awful experience. They just don't want to leave you alone, which is getting Aww. on my nerves. But get a mini. Have a look. Um, mint skinny whips. I've been dying to try these. I've seen a few people um, say about them. I'm mm. so curious to know what it's like inside. I'm gonna have one now. I'm gonna have a bite of. Mm, no, I'll have one now. Um, nice. Um, and then put the rest in the freezer because I love skinny whips. Frozen. 
yeah these if anyone hasn't had these you need to try them they're 99 calories you can get chocolate caramel and strawberry i wouldn't touch the strawberry i hate strawberry chocolate but um mm. they're the ones i love oh my god smell that mm. you that oh my god camera's going down that frozen with a cup of tea is going to be insane mm. i just had an after it yeah bit less minty but sunny mm. for 99p for five that's a dream come true anyway we are now gonna go see my papa i need to check if he's in though first um and then chill maybe go to the cinema tonight if not we're gonna go tomorrow night and i think we're gonna have chicken caesar salad for dinner so if anything really exciting happens i'll show you i might show you my dinner but that's probably about it for today um not too sure if i'll carry on the video for tomorrow or not but if not goodbye and if i do see you tomorrow when i venture out again because look how shiny my face is lord so i forgot the dinner um i'm time my laces that's why i'm really close i really really fancy a chicken caesar salad so we're gonna go to little and get some stuff Love a I'm gonna make my own crouton. No, we wouldn't. Um, we're gonna make our own croutons. Well, I'm gonna make my own croutons. So, yep. so hopefully they turn out good. I might get. I, I have um, like Brennan's Be Good bread, which is only 60 calories a slice, and that's my favourite. And it's white bread, but I might use it, or I might get ciabatta bread, which will obviously be oh, fat ass. Bread and then use it. You fry it. No. We'll just do all that. But yeah, then we're gonna come back and eat that and watch some Netflix. I ow, have been um, sitting the whole time and looking at the furniture and bar stools and sofas and yeah, it's taken ages. But um, I just wanna get a good idea of what I like. And also, yeah gonna go do that my chew you around little my chew you up get my chew you our dinner that's about it you got oh you didn't bring your trainers in i didn't oh you should put them on before we walk around little right i'm gonna go i've just made my salad and taste test big lad wow it was like salmon. Very what? Like salmon. So you said salmon. I haven't tried it yet. My mum tried it and she said it's lovely. So, bon appetit. <laughs>